But guys, here we go in three, two, one. Here we go. I don't have boost. Oh no, everyone else has boost. No, no, I don't have boost. I've got to add that. Okay, <gasps> but the devil has crashed. Yo guys, what's going on? My name is Kabu and welcome back to another Ultimate Driving video. And today guys, an update dropped just a couple of days ago actually. Um, it was a pretty big update, a ton of new cars, a ton of really, really cool new cars came out, including a Bugatti Devo and one of the cars that we're getting to, to buy today. Now, the Devo is way too expensive for me to buy right now. I'm going to try and get enough money for that, but right now, I'm going to try and buy the second uh, most expensive car in this update. And guys, it is going to take all of my money. So, all my money is going to be gone by the end of this video. So, guys, let's go straight into it so of course the vehicles are going to be in the vehicle area garage thing so the car that we're buying today is the second one apollo and i have no idea how to pronounce this car in 10 emozione i have no idea i hope i got that right but this car is 5.4 million and i have 5.6 so i'm going to be left with about 200,000 cash and that that is not a lot at all, but guys, I think this car looks the most insane in this update. Obviously, there's a lot of cool other cars where these little explanation marks are, but also the Bugatti Devo looks pretty nice as well, but that is almost 12 million, and I do not have enough for that. So guys, if you want to come down and check all of these new cars out, um, I definitely would recommend it if you have enough anyway. Uh, the link to this game will be in the description, and guys, I was wrong, I just realised this, the car that I'm about to buy is not the second most expensive car in the update. It is the Lamborghini Venino, and that cost 9 million, guys. This update is more expensive than I ever thought, guys. So I'm going to buy this car right here. I don't really like the purple. Um, I don't know. It makes it look too dark and doesn't stand out as well. Uh, so let's purchase this. Here we go. And of course, guys, we're going to get it in red, like all of our other cars. And guys, I think red, maybe it's just me, but the red looks so much better on this car maybe that's just because i like red most but i don't know let's purchase this car in three two one guys that did that felt so 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 weird now i have two hundred fifty-one thousand cash left oh man guys that took pretty much all of my money but i think this car is worth it it looks absolutely stunning and guys i cannot wait to drive this car Another thing is, guys, I'm on the right side. I'm fairly sure in all of the other cars, you're on the left side. So that's a little bit different of this car. And the turning circle seems to be more realistic. Maybe that's just because I haven't played Ultimate Driving in a while, but this kind of feels a little bit more realistic. I'm not sure. Maybe that is just me. Um, I'm just weird like that. I'm not sure. But guys, look at this car. It goes pretty fast as well. It just, but it looks, I think this car is the nicest looking car of the update. It just looks so, it, it looks vicious. Like, if you saw this car, you know this car can go fast. It looks, from front and back, it looks nice. Like, this car, the massive wing, it looks amazing. There's nothing bad about this car that I can say except the price range. <laughs> but guys, this looks absolutely fantastic. And if you have enough money to buy this, I would definitely recommend you getting this because it looks so so nice so guys if you do want a video on the new lamborghini and the new bugatta then smash that like button guys because that is going to take a lot of money to get them two cars about 20 million and that that is a lot of cash for just two cars so guys smash that like button if you want a video on that but guys we let's test out the top speed of this car so because we're maxing out at around 200 miles per hour so guys let's get into a race and see what this car can hold up against i'm gonna try and get in a race with another supercar hopefully um but yeah guys let's see how well this car can hold up against another supercar okay guys so we have a couple of cars here actually there's one more person that pro might want to race let's add him in but guys we have the brand new bugatti Devo. Now, guys, I don't expect to win this race at all. We also have a Dodge, uh, but yeah, guys, I think I'm gonna come second. Uh, oh no, I just missed the Venom. I am sorry, dude. I just pressed ready when he joined. But guys, here we go in three, two, one. Here we go. I don't have boost. Oh no, everyone else has boost. No, no, I don't have boost. I've got to add that. 
Okay, <gasps> but the devil's crashed. Oh my word, this this could be a victory right here. I could actually win this. No, the devil crashing actually helped. It actually helped him. Oh my word, that crash right at the beginning. That helped him, he went zooming past, that's crazy. Oh man, but he says I'm in first. Okay, this, this could be, this is really good. It says I'm in first. Let's keep this up. Hopefully we can actually finish first. But guys, the devil actually left. I think he, yeah, he said he gave up. But I'm not sure why. Maybe he crashed into the water or something like that. But guys, this car could actually win. I know it in a fair comparison. But I guess we can say we won against the devil. Uh, but we still have the dodge to look out for. I don't think he'll be catching up anytime soon though. I mean, if my um, bad driving, I don't know. I keep crashing into the side of the wall. It's this car though. This car seems to be like a magnet. I, I'm trying to pull away from the wall right now. There we go, finally. It's like a magnet to the wall. That is so weird. Maybe they might need to fix like the turning on this car because I was turning for a while there to get away from the wall and it did nothing. So that was a bit of, that was weird. But guys, I think we are going to win this one. We don't have the best of time, but we are first on the west in this nice looking car. I still have no idea how to pronounce this car, so I'm just going to call it a nice looking car. Because I guess that's what it is. Um, but if you have enough money, definitely get this. I know maybe you guys might not like it as much as me, but to me, it looks so, so nice. Ultimate driving is definitely the best. What on earth just happened here? I crashed into nothing. Okay, but guys, ultimate driving is right now the best car game ever, I think. Because, like, the, the cars just don't compare to any other game on Roblox. But for now, anyway. Okay, here we go. We're almost at the finish line. We've just a couple of feet left. And there we go. We have finished first. We have finished strong. Look at that with a time of 2 minutes and 40 seconds not that bad when we was against the divo i'm not gonna count that as a win against the divo because they did back down fairly early on but guys we got a new high score that's that's pretty good so i'm gonna race back over to west over and hopefully get the divo back in here maybe that venom that we saw earlier and do another race hopefully the divo won't crash or back out this time because I want to see how close it will be against the Divo. Probably not that close, but I just want to see the time comparisons anyway. So I'll meet you back at Westover. Okay, guys, so we are now just arriving at Westover. Okay, guys, so we have two Venoms here waiting. But guys, just looking around this car, this car just looks so, so nice. It's just got all the curves in the right places, I guess. It just, it definitely stands out. I mean, the Venom looks nice as well, but compared to this car, it doesn't compare, I don't think, anyway. This car, it just looks so, so, so much nicer. But guys, what's your favourite car in the new update? I'm guessing a lot of people are going to say the new Bugatti. I just don't like the look of Bugattis at all. Uh, I probably don't know, people will probably disagree, but that is my opinion there. I just don't like the look of Bugattis one bit. I'm not sure why. But anyway, not, let's stop talking about that and let's get on with another race. So we're going to race over to South Beach this time because uh, New York was a little bit far and it was a long long race so let's just do a fairly short one okay guys here we go get ready I forgot to add boost again no that venom is probably gonna have the boost um the basic boost hopefully hopefully not it's not the advanced boost but there it is a boost nonetheless hopefully we'll be able to keep up I think the venom is just a little bit faster I say a little bit faster but it speeds off like that but I am for some reason I seem to be connecting to these walls like a magnet. I've said this before, but that is, it's so weird because I can't like get away that easily. I stick on the wall and it slows me down so, so much. Uh, but we are second, but look at this guys. I'm trying to pull away and I was stuck to that wall and it put me down to half of my speed. Okay, that is one thing I do not like about this car at all. It seems to be a wall magnet. What is going on? Oh my word, I mean, uh, I normally crash into walls, but I can pull away so much easier, even on this little wall here. I'm pressing turn, but it won't turn. And it takes me down to 100 miles per hour. This is so annoying. Okay, then, I wouldn't really choose this uh, car in a race, and if it keeps doing that. But apart from that, it's a really, really nice car. Definitely not a, definitely not a good racing car right now, anyway. Hopefully, hopefully they'll fix it. And over the random taxi stuck here. Maybe I can just uh, edge past him a little bit. Okay, but it doesn't matter. The first guy that was in a Venom has 
finish the race. We wasn't that far behind. We were far behind, but it wasn't that far. Um, but let's see the times anyway. Hopefully, it'll pop up. There we go. So, about 20 seconds behind, 22 seconds. So, not that bad for a car, but I think the Venom is cheaper than this car, and it is faster. So, for the looks of this car, it is definitely worth the money. Maybe not for the um, max speed of it. But guys, I would definitely recommend this car. But guys, I'm going to end the video off here, guys. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, smash that like button for another Ultimate Driving Update video. There is a new map um, on Ultimate Driving as well called Monroe. Which I'll probably be doing a video on that very shortly, guys. So keep an eye out for that one. And if, smash that like button if you do want to see the two new cars. The new Bugatti and the new Lamborghini. And um, hopefully I'll have enough money for that very shortly. And guys, thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already, make sure you subscribe. Turn on that notification bell so you don't miss a video or live stream by me. And guys, I'll see you in the next video. Bye, guys.